The following contest is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring from Cincinnati, Ohio, weighing in at 225 pounds, Dean Ambrose. Man, listening to the reaction this guy gets from a crowd never gets old. Which one of these two will walk away with the win? We'll find out as this one gets underway in mere moments. And approaching the ring. Where's this going? Well, I think it's going to be a highlight reel. We knew this could happen. Oh, you knew, Cole? Look out! Wow, that's using your imagination. Oh, lights out! Oh, did you see that? I have a funny feeling that this is gonna turn it. That's it, it's over, it's over! Extras, will it be enough for the win? You gotta believe this one's over. How do you feel about this devil may care style of Cactus Jacks? Definitely looking confident in this one-on-one -on -one environment. That's a good sign. I have a strong feeling these guys will throw caution to the wind and just go full steam ahead. I hope you're right. That's exactly what I want to see. Oh, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. It's no surprise that someone the likes of Dean Ambrose would utilize a lethal maneuver like his 30 deeds finisher. Oh, it's awesome. Wow, if he keeps this up, this could be over quick. Must have calls me. Oh my gosh! Ouch, he's going to be bruised from head to toe before this one's over. Another amazing singles contest. These two never cease to entertain the WWE Universe. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. I don't like his entire face. Michael, you mentioned Dean Ambrose and his Dirty Deeds finisher. It looks like a descendant of the DDT. When Ambrose nails an opponent with that, you can hear everyone in the arena gasp at the same time. That move's annihilating. Yet another one for the highlight reel. Oh, there's a lot to hit there. And again, he gets struck with that object. Oh, my. Get the medics down here. Dean Ambrose is just on a rampage. He's relentless. Wow, he's still down after that. Watching the superstars file into the arena earlier today, you could tell that they have a just a different mindset. I mean, they know the dangers that go along with competing in extreme rules. When you think of the time Dean Ambrose took to create his offensive armory, if you will, the Dirty Deeds is a finisher that reflects Ambrose in-ring offensive philosophy. Fast, lethal, and out of nowhere. Oh, Cole, you name them, and there's a really good chance they felt the force of the Dirty Deeds finishing move, courtesy of Dean Ambrose. Great match here, but if you missed any of the matches from this week, go to W. Oh, oh my God! Here we go. Last over with the rebound, Larian. Oh, that had to hurt. Guys, of all of Mick Foley's faces, I'd have to say Cactus Jack is the most unpredictable. I mean, you never know what he's going to do in the ring. And you know what? 
I'm not so sure he even knows what he's going to do in there. This guy feeds off the energy from the crowd as much as he feeds off pain. No doubt about it. Dean Ambrose is in charge. Cactus Jack being pressed hard. Oh my God, I can't believe what we've seen thus far. What can possibly happen next? Watch it, watch it. Oh my God, I can't believe this. Look at that. The table just imploded from that impact. I can't believe what we just witnessed. Yeah, in all my years in this business, and we were putting people through tables in Memphis in the 80s. I don't think I've ever seen a table just collapse like that before. That's it. He's done. If you're just tuning in, I'm Michael Cole. Thank you for joining us on this Tuesday evening. Cactus Jack reverses it. Quick thinking to avoid that. Oh, his body has to be broken right now. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. Keep the action inside the ring. That's where you're going to win this thing. I've seen every episode of SmackDown over the years, and I assure you this one ranks right up there with the best. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. I get warm up the buses. This one's over. Boy, he just got laid out. I can't tell you how many victims have suffered the same fate. Oh, look at this. When you go at an opponent like this, it means... And I think it's obvious that he'll stop at nothing to win here tonight. Oh, not again. Not again. What an attack. Take it from me, there's never a good place or a good time to get hit. WWE's not like other sports where you call a timeout after a major hit. The match goes on. Watch it. Oh, nobody home. This Jack with a nice reversal. Cactus Jack has found an answer here. What a predicament. You don't need to be a physician to know that the human body is makes the cover. Plenty of fight left. You're right. This guy's still near 100%. Dean Ambrose is not going to go away that easy. Direct hits like that help put your opponent away fast and early. Oh, look out. When Dean Ambrose picks up steam like this, he can just keep on coming. And he can attack from any point in an arena. That could mean you'll end up literally running into a brick wall. Get ready for chaos. That stop might have only lasted a second, but it's going to be felt tomorrow. That may be felt for a lifetime. Uh-oh. Oh, no. We know what this is. Lasso to the rebound. Lariat. Oh, that had to hurt. Boy, he is really tired now. That tank of his has to be reading empty. It has to be King, but I still don't see him giving up. And there's the butterfly DDT. Why would you name something as vicious as a DDT a butterfly? Extreme rules is such a dangerous night. Anytime you throw the rule book out the window, somebody is bound to get seriously hurt. Man, that's gotta hurt. This is the kind. This should do it right there. I think this is it. Two.
You could call this a good old-fashioned butt-whooping. Yeah, that's exactly what we're witnessing. A butt-whooping. Cactus Jack reverses it. He's focusing on the face now. Cactus, and he kicks out. And he lives to fight again. Cole, Dean Ambrose knows where he is in that ring at all times. Good Lord, he's just hell-bent on maiming his opponent. That's how you move up the ladder here in WWE. Look at that. It's all academic from here. Looks to me like the gas tank is at about halfway. You want to make sure it doesn't get close enough to E, though. That's for sure. This match has taken so much out of this guy. He's not going to give up. But, man, this has been physical. Oh, they're taking a risk here. That's how you win matches. These guys are giving it absolutely everything they've got. They're not holding anything back, and I love it. Oh, man, from the high rent district. I wouldn't know what that's like. I got to tell you, these guys are in the best shape I've ever seen them in. That's a different type of focus to punish an opponent like this. Yeah, you really have to enjoy hurting someone. Watching the superstars file into the arena earlier today, you could tell that they have a just a different mindset. I mean, they know the dangers that go along with competing in extreme rules. Covers. And he breaks the cover, forcing the referee to stop the count. Well, that's just not enough to get the job done. I don't believe it. He refuses to lose. And here he comes. You can never count Dean Ambrose out. We know he's a lunatic fringe. We know there's no questioning his desire and ability to fight. But what we'll find out in due time is can his stamina stand the test of time in this one? Now that's the question. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching SmackDown, the second longest running weekly episodic television program in history. Oh, that may have hurt Cactus Jack. Dean Ambrose again looking to launch an attack from the air. No! You take a chance like that, do you know? Will this be it? I think he's got it. Extreme Rules is such a dangerous night. Anytime you throw the rule book out the window, somebody is bound to get seriously hurt. Look at this. This could be it. Rebound. Larry and Ambrose knows this one's just about over. Oh, Dean Ambrose, I'm telling you, this guy knows what to do in that ring. The running knee lift is going to end it. Dean Ambrose has got this. Looks like we can notch another victory in the belt of Dean Ambrose. King, I think you're right about something. Wow, what a win.